if you can see that poster right there. Thousand, ten thousand dollars off MSRP. That sign said ten thousand dollars off manufactured suggested retail price. Ten thousand dollars off. Wait, what does that really mean, right? It means squat. It means jack squat, really, at the end of the day when you think about it. You know, you could say anything. Twenty thousand off, fifty, a hundred thousand dollars off the. the my, I think you should sell this for two hundred and fifty thousand. We're going to give you a hundred thousand off. It doesn't mean anything. So one of the guys that I follow on YouTube, his name is Codename. <laughs> I think that's kind of creative. What's, what's your name, Codename? Anyway, uh, check him out. He's a pretty cool guy. He uh, does live dumpster diving, which I think is pretty pretty incredible. Uh, and he just uh, left me a comment on my previous video saying, yeah, it is just too damn cold to, uh, to go scrapping. <laughs> Although I think I see a cord. Maybe worth looking into here. Another cord right there. Here. I know some of you are going to say, Shane, you need to take that stand, but I don't have the tools to take that off of there. You know what? It's cold out here. So yeah, check out uh, Codename. I'll put his name up on the screen here. Oh, I wish this guy wasn't out here shoveling or whatever he's doing because I see some metal or something right there on top. Come back to this. There's three TVs on the ground there. One's got the back busted off of it. I see one still has a cord on it. So let's go get some cords. So what's neat about uh, Codename is that he does live dumpster diving. So he'll actually go out and take you with him while he goes all over town and hits a bunch of really cool dumpsters. And the last time I watched him was the first time I watched him actually. Uh, and he, he just made a huge score at uh, these computer stores that were throwing out parts and stuff. And man, I nailed it. I mean, he had, he had nailed it. He had laptops and he had monitors and man, you, you name it. It's just... It was incredible. I'd sure hate to go down this hill on a, on a icy day. Holy cow. Anyway, check out Codename. Cool guy, funny guy. Uh, he, he engages with you as you uh, watch him live. And uh, just a really fun guy to watch. So check him out if you, get, if you get him in there, if you're looking for something different to watch. So I can't remember if I did mention the reason I brought up Codename other than he's got good stuff is because he commented on my post today that it's just too damn cold for him to be out there dumpster diving and I totally agree especially when he dumpster dives at night and the temperature just plummets so okay so I'm back here again hoping this guy is done shoveling and out of the way so I can see what's in that dumpster but if he's still there we're going to take off and forget about it Over there. Oh. 
Okay, so this is Harbor Freight in Clinton. Nothing. So this is the cardboard here. And then that must be where the good stuff goes when it's there. So Moonbeam said that it got so cold where she's at that uh, it cracked some pipes in her house. Cute little table over there. You know, if I did flea markets or something like that, I'd probably grab that table. Otherwise, I really don't have a use for it. So... I think I'm gonna pass it up with maybe some cutting boards there. See those? Let's go to the other side, Mike. Oh, it was some type of a piece of furniture you put together. Well, there is some metal down there at the bottom. There's some stuff there too. That better be a pokey. Those are the poles that went between those things there. So I got the metal out of that last one. It's gotta be like the shortest freaking dumpsters on the planet. <laughs> This caught my attention from the road. I thought maybe it was one of those metal cabinets, but it's all wood and crap. Old mattress filling that thing up. TV, get the cord cut ready. Uh, a couple of those. So I grabbed those bed supports from there. So, so far it's been a day of cords and metal, some metal. No, nothing uh, real good as far as resellable treasures. But the day is young. Drop my phone there. That'd be bad. Huh. Uh oh. You know what that means? They're all going to be empty today. So I've tried several new apartment complexes today. And I have to admit, nothing's really panned out here so far. This 
some of these are just so awkward to you almost have to park and walk to them. Mm. Well, I see a vacuum cleaner box. And I see a vacuum cleaner. Oh, yeah, baby. Who's your daddy? Check it out. Ooh, there's a ballast there, too. All right. It's got the attachment and the canister on it. Sweet. Sweet, nice little score. I am not kidding. That is the dumpster that I just pulled the vacuum cleaner out of. You believe that? <laughs> Woo! That was meant to be, I think. Holy cow! I'm check these real quick before the garbage man, which you can see him right there, is coming around the corner. See him there? He's following me. down there. Maybe a heater of some sort, I don't know. Or a waffle iron. I want to grab my, oh there it is. See that? It's a head, there's a crock pot, crock pot bump beneath that bag there. I want to grab my pick, pick and stick. Okay, so first things first. Just like that. Throw it in the van. Just like that. And express ready set go. Right into my van. Ready set go right into my van. Bam. Just like that. This is the one we drove past when we first came in. Mm, yeah, nothing. Couple of tins there. Aluminum screen. Bring them when I'm not too much. Got life on it. <laughs> I guess I'll take those off. Huh? A lot of wire hangers. Oh, there's a fan, but there's all sorts of crud all over it. Yeah, might cut the cord though. Right here. Crock pot. Alright, I'm gonna cut the cord. I'm gonna grab those. I'm gonna grab the crock pot and see what else might be in here.
we go. Good morning, YouTube land. How is everyone out there this cold morning? If you will see right here, I took a screenshot of it. It is zero degrees outside. Zero degrees, not even a degree. Not a negative degree, a zero degree outside. So yesterday it was six degrees. Uh, today it's zero degrees and uh, I'm actually heading up to see my parents. I checked out their area and it was negative seven degrees up there. So, kind of crazy, kind of cold, not sure if we're going to get any dumpster diving in today, maybe a little thrifting, we'll see, but anyway, let's start the day. says that uh, you have a container of hers with the blue lid from this summer when she sent home some apples with you. Okay. I said, well, you tell mom that uh, she's not going to get it back. Finders keepers, losers weepers. And he says, Darlene, he said you can't have it back. Finders keepers, Losers, leapers. I said, no, losers, weepers, as in crying. Huh? Weeping, as in crying. Darling, he said something about lying. Oh. No, Dad. Weepers. Losers, weepers, as in crying. Oh, I can't understand what you're saying. Never mind. He goes, I'll see you in a little bit. No, that's just covered up just like it is. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I ain't going to get in there. Hey, no, stand back. Yeah. Come on now. Get in there. That a girl. Yeah, that I always put your eye on. So just vomiting and yeah, I think I feel good. And this morning I found her laying up in that well, the tub uh, sink like we had all summer, and we catch well. Right, everybody I just left mom and dad's house got the cat taken to the vet had some lunch with him all that good stuff so uh, I thought I'd swing down here to Goodwill real quick we've been having a lot of sales on the toy uh, Etsy account 
sold the John Deere tractor, sold the uh, Minecraft doll, sold some more Legos. So there's been a lot of activity on that account, uh, more than the rest. So I think I'm gonna come in here and see if we can't find some more inventory for the toy store. Let's go take a look. Okay, everybody. So yeah, I found some uh, good toys and some hats at Goodwill. I got good deals on some things. I already checked on a few of them while I was there and uh, we're gonna be able to turn some pretty good money on them. So I'll go over that uh, at the end of the video, kind of a summary. But for now, I thought we'd head back and just uh, hit a few more dumpsters for this video. Tomorrow is uh, Saturday. There is an auction up in Alito again. Thought I might go to that one, I'm not sure. Uh, but then Sunday definitely is going to be 30 to 32 degrees out. So I'm definitely going to go dumpster diving. Uh, that's going to feel like a freaking heat wave compared to where we've been lately. So looking forward to that. So that's kind of what's coming up. Uh, so let's go do some dumpster diving, head home and do a summary. And we'll call this one finished. Quick shout out to Mandy Boyd. She uh, left a comment today on my other video saying, saying that she had pulled a shoulder muscle and she was enjoying the videos um, so Mandy thanks for your comment hope you feel better soon um, just uh, sending you lots of love I hope you're doing all right so take care of yourself heal up and be safe Holy shit, guys, look at that. That's gotta be copper. Holy crap. You think that's copper, guys? <laughs> Dude, I grabbed all that wire. I think it's copper. I took a magnet to it, it didn't stick. Excuse my hat. So yeah, I think that's all freaking copper, dude. I mean, look at the size. Okay, this is my hand against that. I mean, I don't know, I guess worst case scenario, it's just shred, but that looks like copper in there to me. I'd say that's copper. So check it out, I just took a, a knife to it. That is wrapped literally in a copper wire. That whole thing, all that, 
all that rolls of wire I got behind me there. It's all copper. I was wrong, it's not a wire, but it is like a sheath or a casing. Wow. That's incredible. I wonder what that's worth, all that wire's worth. I mean, all that's copper. you believe that? I can't believe it. up here and get both of those. So I don't know if you can see behind me there. There's a microwave back there in that corner. And then see that round base back there? That's a lamp base. I stopped at another complex and for some reason my, my phone froze up so I couldn't videotape it. So I grabbed that as well. So this thing <laughs> just unloaded it the other day and it to, to empty it out and we're already getting full again. So been a good couple days to dumpster diving here. So anyway, let's go home. I'm gonna go through what we got at the Goodwill and wrap this thing up. Okay, so for the summary, we're gonna start off here. This is the Fisher Price Thanksgiving celebration. Um, you kind of see all the things that should have come with there. And most of it's there except for um, the pilgrims are not. But everything else seems to be there. It was 250. And I already found out that this pumpkin by itself sells for $6.50. And uh, it goes on like that. Like the picnic table sells for so much. This sells for so much. You know, the little, the little uh, Native Americans sell for so much. So I could easily break this down and probably sell the entire contents of this box for 30 bucks individually. So I was pretty happy about that. Next up we have... This Hot Wheels track and build system spin launch, it was $1.50, and it is all in the original box. It has never been opened. Uh, one just like this sold on eBay for $18.50, free shipping. Next up, we have this Barbie, I'll call it a Barbie Jeep. Um, it was $3.50. I have not touched it yet, um, but I think it probably works. I don't know what it's sell for, but I'll put that up on the screen once I know. And I will let you know if it tested out okay or not. And then lastly, I got this guy for me because I love it. <laughs> Who wouldn't love to have that? All right, and then I got the uh, White Sox hat. It's really nice. It's got that original uh, uh, Major League Baseball item on it. Nine fifty. Hawkeyes embroidered hat. Very nice. Again, Hawkeyes embroidered hat. John Deere trucker hats. There's two of them with the mesh back. So two bucks a piece. So there's ten bucks for the hats. Easily get almost twice that for some of these. So I'm very happy with that as well. So it works. So guys, I think that's gonna wrap it up for the day. We had a really good two days dumpster diving, going through these apartment complexes. We got microwaves, crock pots, lamps, cords. 
unbelievable amount of stuff in the last couple days. Um, and not to mention that huge copper score that we got today. I cannot wait to see what that's worth. But anyway, uh, totally stoked about that. I just want to thank you all. Uh, we are at 450 plus subscribers. Thank you each and every one of you. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Uh, thank you so much for subscribing to this. Uh, I am not monetized yet or anything like that. So everything I do, I just kind of do because I love doing it. And uh, sometimes that's the best reason of all. So anyway, thanks again for tuning in, guys. Have a good night. Stay warm. And we will definitely see you at the next dumpster. Peace out, everybody. Bye-bye.